Welcome everybody to a brand new video. There's not gonna be any gameplay in today's video. Instead, it's just a sit down and talk to the camera sort of video. I've done these before in the past, but there is a reason for this one. I just wanna talk about something that I've been thinking of for the past few days. By the way, I just wanna mention that I look good as fuck in today's video. I mean, holy shit, sexy. But anyway, enough of that. I'm not going to beat around the bush. What I wanna talk about today is just me in my current state, where I'm at in my life, and kind of let you guys know about that. I don't know, this seems really random, but trust me, there is a reason for this video. It's something that I've been thinking about a lot. Now, in my past few videos, I have been talking about things that have been going on in my life, you know, obtaining a new job, barista course, you know, a bunch of stuff. And once in a while in my videos, I have mentioned that I am currently in the best place in my entire life. And that's basically what the topic of this video is. I want to talk about the fact that I am in such a great place in my life. And I kind of just want to talk about that in general, because looking back on it, maybe over a year ago, maybe a year and a half ago to two years ago to two and a half years ago, I was in a very shit spot in my life. I was at a point where I was suicidal. I hated my life. I just really didn't want to go forward. I couldn't look forward to the future. I wasn't optimistic whatsoever. I was just so caught up in everything that was going on in my own head. I had very little motivation to even do YouTube and just do anything in my life really. But things have changed a lot. I'd say ever since a year and a half ago, things started looking up. I started doing a lot more things in my life and I've just felt better as a person and I feel better now than ever ever. A lot of things have changed in my life and I feel like I shouldn't take that for granted. I should come out on a video, talk to you guys about how I personally feel and for any of you guys, if, if any of you guys were wondering about how I am as a person, I'm very good. Thank you for asking. Nobody's asking. As I said earlier, I don't want to take these times for granted because two years ago, I would have just dreamed about being in the place that I am right now. I'm done with school. I can do YouTube whenever I want. I can stream whenever I want. I have a good job and I have a job coming just around the corner, a full-time job that is way better. I'm going to be in a better environment with better pay, etc. I'm going to talk about that in a later video, probably around next week, maybe on Monday or on Tuesday, I don't know, it depends what I'm uploading. But basically, two years ago, I would have killed to be in the place that I'm in right now. And I'm just so happy, I'm so grateful that I have all of this equipment around me, that everything is just going so well in my life. And I understand that that's probably not going to be the case forever. I am going to have something happen in my life at some point that is going to bring my mood down. But I definitely don't exactly see myself going back to the place that I was two years ago. Some people will say that I was depressed and I don't really like to say that I was depressed because I never got a diagnosis from an actual professional stuff like that but yeah some people could have definitely said that I was depressed I was suicidal but I don't want to take my life at all these days like I'm just so happy I'm so optimistic I'm so looking forward to the future but I'm not stupid as much as I am in such a great place in my life I realize that there are other people out there who still aren't doing the best people out there who sort of just wish they could have my life and I don't want to sound braggadocious when I say that that's not like a humble brag or something like that it's just I'm doing very well for myself personally I am very happy with where I'm at and I know a lot of people really wish that they could be in my position you know that's why I don't want to take it for granted because I understand that other people would kill for what I have so basically because I was in such a terrible place in my life maybe two years ago two and a half years ago I wanted to make this video for the people who haven't gotten to the point where I'm at now who are still struggling every single day in their own heads in their own lives and basically just kind of give some words of of not advice but just some words of optimism and just I hope this can maybe make you look forward to the future and maybe tell you guys what I did and maybe what you could do first of all I know that everybody says this and when I heard it I didn't believe it but trust me you will once you get out of that dark place in your life everybody says it's not going to last forever and that you'll get over it and I understand that 
no matter how many times people say that to you, you don't believe it the same way that I didn't believe it. I thought that I was just simply going to be stuck like that for the rest of my life and there was nothing I could do about it. And I know that no matter how many times people say that, you're saying that your situation is different. And I don't knock that your situation is different. Everybody has different experiences. Everybody is going through their own shit. But just believe that no matter how bad things get, they won't be like that forever. You will push through. Fuck, if I could have done it, you guys can too. I used to believe that I was weak, that there was nothing I could do about this feeling, and I just had to suffer and just accept it. That's the things I used to tell myself. I used to tell myself that I didn't deserve to be happy, that I was weak, and no matter what happened, that nothing was going to get better. And it did. Eventually, I picked myself up and I said, I'm done. I'm not going to hurt anymore because eventually you get sick of it. You get sick of being sad. You get sick of being in that place and you want to do something about it. And I did do something about it. I just decided to just move on with my life from all of the bad things that were going on. And I decided to, you know, look for a job, pursue YouTube more. And it makes me very happy every single day that I do it. To anybody out there who is going through a tough time, just trust me you can get through it. I wasn't the strongest person in the world, but I managed to get through it. Trust me, if I could do it, you can do it. If I were to give a little piece of advice, and I don't want to sound condescending, I don't want to tell you what to do with your life, but if you find that you are stuck, that you just don't know what you want to do with your life, you don't know where to go, just find something that you love. Have something to accomplish create a task for yourself, have something to work towards. I find that whenever I am going through my own personal struggles, whenever I have like a bad day, having something to work towards and actually accomplishing something is one of the most gratifying feelings you can have. I personally keep myself busy with my job, you know, making money and making YouTube videos. I have something that keeps me occupied and you find that when you have your own schedule, when you do things that you personally like, you can't really be sad. Even if you go through your own hard times, you focus on the bright side because you're focusing on all these things that you're creating. I don't know, maybe for you it's starting a business. Maybe for you it's making YouTube videos. Maybe for you it's just going over to a friend's house. Whatever it is that you can do to just take your mind off of the negative things, try and surround yourself with more positivity. Try and work towards something. I don't know, go to the gym, go for a walk. I don't know. I know it's really basic advice and a lot of people will tell you this and you'll just, you know, brush it off as if, you know, you can't understand what situation I'm in and nobody can. I'll be very blunt. Nobody can understand the situation that you're in. But just know that no matter what you're going through, it will get better. I know it's really difficult to accept that and it's very difficult to believe that because I didn't believe it, but things will get better. I promise. Who am I? Just some small YouTuber. I know that I have absolutely no authority in this situation to tell you that things will get better, but I've seen it myself. Life can, you know, throw you a bone once in a while. If you're young, you know, under the age of 18, the best thing I could tell you is just work on your future. Working on your future is, for me, what really works. It really helps me just feel happy about life because as you accomplish things more and more and more, you get into this routine of just accomplishing more and more things. And then eventually you sit down, you look back at all the accomplishments that you have made for yourself, and you realize that you really have nothing to be sad about. I personally didn't really have much to be sad about. I was dwelling on the past and that doesn't fix anything. I think no matter what you're going through, try and look towards the future. Try and work towards something because you will feel better doing that. I think if you spend some time in personal development, it can really pay off. And I know it's difficult. It's easier said than done because when you're at the point where it's literally like so hard to even get out of bed in the morning because, you know, when you're suffering from depression, it can get to that point. It can get to the point where it's even tough just getting out of bed, getting into the shower and just getting through your day. Sometimes you just wish you could just sit there and not do anything. I get it, it's really difficult, but you need to find whatever little bit of hope you have inside of you. Cause I know that there's some there. There is a little bit of something inside of you that 
can push forward, that can do something. Make a change today. Don't make a change tomorrow. Don't make a change next week. Make a change today. And it doesn't have to be actually going out and doing something. It can be a change in your mind. Tell yourself that you're ready to move forward because some of you guys have probably been in this situation, you know, sad, not in the greatest place in your life. Some of you guys may have been there for a few days, a few weeks, months, years. Maybe some of you guys have been like that throughout your entire life, but it starts with you. Nobody else can fix your problems. It starts with you telling yourself that you're ready to make your life better and make a change is a great first step. And yeah, I just, that's what I think you guys could do. I don't want to give you guys this advice as if I know who you are and I know what you're going through, but just try your best to focus on the things that you do have. Don't focus on the things that you don't have. Focus on what you do have. And after you're done focusing on what you have, focus on getting more. If you try and focus on getting more, and not in necessarily a way of materialism, don't focus on getting the next pair of shoes. I just mean, get more out of life. Try and do something meaningful. Try and do something purposeful with your time because when you look back on it you will be happy and you will be satisfied one last time before i wrap this video up here just if you're going through tough times the best thing i can tell you is that it will pass stick in there don't do some stupid shit like take your own life like i wanted to do because i'm so fucking happy that i decided not to because now i am in the greatest point in my entire life and trust me if you put the work in if you try to do your best in life and have something to work towards, you will get to the best point in your life and you will be so happy that you decided to put those pills down, that you decided to put that rope away, whatever it is, you will be so happy that you chose not to do what you wanted to do. You will get through, you will get better and you will get to a point where you're just happy and going on with life and enjoying it. I'm sorry if I rambled at any points in this video and if anybody's watching this video and they feel like they just wasted their time watching it, you didn't enjoy it, you didn't think my advice was helpful, I'm sorry I couldn't help you, but yeah, I'm gonna wrap this video up here. Thank you so much to everybody who watched this video, thank you to everybody who supports me, and uh, good luck to anybody watching this video who needs the advice or needs some words of reassurance. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.